Hi traders, this is Forex Nelson and I'm back again today with nine trades. Today's date is August the 10th and I'm using my new FX trigger system. Please keep in mind whoever picks up my FX trigger system, I'll show you how you can get your hands on this very valuable trading app. It's called the Trading Simulator for the MT4 platform. It'll allow you to practice 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I do it on the weekend when the market is closed. I like to put in a couple of hundred trades um, or as many as what I feel like doing over the weekend. And um, this sharpens my uh, trading, my buy and sell entry orders. You can have many of them running at a time. You can do hedging. It does come with a 25 page um, ebook, which guides you through all the features and all the different options that you are able to um, use within the app. So if you want to speed up your learning curve, like one year's worth of trading experience, let's say over the weekend, I really highly recommend that you get your hands on this trading simulator. So it did a world of good for me as within 30 days I was able to double my pip totals uh, day in and day out. Now before I get into these trades, um, I would like to inform you that all trading systems will work less than 50% of the time and that includes all my trigger systems. It took me 8 years and over 700 trading systems to learn that. To get that up to 80 or 90% success rate, you'll have to learn how to trade the flow of the market which is what I teach. You will also have to learn trade management and money management. To be successful in trading, all you need is a lot of chart time, a lot of demo trading, and a lot of education. I provide the education. You must buy the education and then do the homework or you will fail at trading. I highly suggest putting in more than one trade at a time as no one knows which pair will move the greatest number of pips. That is why I place three or more trades at a time. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. This will encourage me to do more of these videos. If you leave your name and email address, I will put you on my email list for free weekly trading tips. So please keep that in mind as I move forward. So getting into these trades. Took all the trades this morning before 7 a.m. And I closed them out uh, just a little bit. One of them I closed out very early because I was happy with the totals on this uh, crude oil. But um, the rest of them were around 10 and 10.30, as you can see here. I try to be done with my trading by approximately 10 o'clock in the morning. So for a few hours work, um, you know, I am very happy and that allows me to carry on the rest of the day to do whatever I please. And that is why I got into trading um, almost 17 years ago. I wanted to make 10 times more money and only work a couple hours a day. It does take time to learn this. You're not going to learn this in 30 days. But if you keep at it and keep practicing you will figure it out eventually. So moving right along, let's see now, pound Swiss. Now the bulk of these trades were a great way to trade except for a few, uh, I think two of them. So I took the trade at this cursor, here's my stop. It wasn't, uh, wasn't uh, that big to begin with. It was only about nine pips and it wouldn't as I mentioned earlier, nobody knows which one is going to produce the pips. And after a while, I got tired of waiting and waiting. And once I see that I'm happy, and usually I'm happy with 100 or more pips, uh, then I close out all the trades. 
here I got five pips and five pips on the pound Swiss paid $541. And of course the uh, FX trigger system, these blue lines and the blue boxes, they were also suggesting to buy. Moving right along to the pound dollar from way back when it was suggesting to buy so that's exactly what I did drag and drop it up now it wouldn't go very much from this point did a cycle and then it went back up again so I just had to weather this little bit of a cycle keep in mind that before I pull the trigger on every one of these trades I do drill down the lights from the higher time frames I want to make sure that I'm going in the direction of the trend and that helps to increase my win rate up to more than 80%. Got in at this cursor, went against me about 25 pips, decided to close it out after waiting and waiting, ended up with six pips and six pips on the pound dollar paid $600. Moving on to the next trade, Euro New Zealand. Another one that qualified for a great way to trade. We'll drag this up and see where I got in at. And I got in just prior to the signal. If you drop it down, I learned this is a trick. If you drop it down to the five minutes, you'll get an earlier signal. Let's see. And on this, the signal was from way back here so let's see took a trade at this cursor right here everything was screaming to sell so that's what I did sold it went against me about nine pips maybe ten ten pips and if I would have stayed in the trade longer I would have made more but as I said I closed them all out once I hit a hundred pips or more this produced 10 pips, and 10 pips on the Euro New Zealand paid $699. And this trade also qualified for a great way to trade. Next trade was the Euro Aussie. Let's drag and drop it up. This one here, I took the trade here, did qualify for a great way to trade. It was saying to sell, the trigger system was saying to sell from this point. So that's exactly what I did. Went against me six pips and looks like I closed it out with 15 pips and 15 pips on the Euro Aussie paid $1,174. Now you can see the benefits of doing more than one trade at a time. And it does take time to learn and get good at this way of trading. Let's see, pound yen. And this uh, trade here did qualify for a great way to trade. Looks like another one, perfect example of a great way to trade. System from here was saying to buy. That's where I bought, right here. Now it did go against me and I knew that it could go back to the um, moving averages didn't bother me. My stop was down there. 27 pips. It went 25 pips against me. Not a big deal. And I closed it out here just being happy with 16 pips. And 16 pips on the pound yen paid $1,447. Remember, you don't need a lot of pips to make a lot of money. But you do have to have trade trade management and money management in proper order. Pound New Zealand. Now this one here, I do believe did not qualify for a great way to trade. I did sell it. Let's drop it down to the five minutes. It was suggesting to sell and the boxes um, were suggesting that also. So I took the trade right here at this cursor as I said, it did not qualify for a great way to trade. And I knew the higher time frames were in my favor. So I took the trade. Went about seven pips against me. And I closed it out being happy with, uh, could have made a lot more, by the way. Um, 
you know, like over 40 pips, 45 pips, but I was happy with 23 pips. And 23 pips on the pound New Zealand paid $1,607. Okay, let's move on to the next trade. I did oil. I've been looking at oil a lot lately as it moves a lot. S trigger system was saying to buy. So at the time, that's exactly what it did. Now I only got a little bit here. Then it did a pullback and then it shot up and I wish I would have cut this, but um, nonetheless, I'm still very happy. Looks like I ended up with 17 and 17 uh, ticks paid out uh, $1,700. Let's move on to the next trade, Pound Aussie. Let's see where I got in at. Sold it just after it cleared the goal line. Did not qualify for a great way to trade, but I teach exactly how to trade this way in the two videos called how to trade the goal line. So, went down about 22 pips, came back to the moving averages and finally dropped as the higher time frame suggested it would. Ended up with 29 pips and 29 pips on the pound Aussie paid $2,128. Okay, moving on to the last trade. Euro CAD, drag and drop it up. Did qualify for a great way to trade. FX trigger system was saying to sell it, so that's exactly what I did. Took the trade here, did go against me 12 pips. Could have made a lot more, over 60 but I was happy with 31, and those 31 pips on the EuroCAD paid $2,468. So, another great day of trading using my FX trigger system. Ended up with um, well over my 100 pips uh, goal. I ended up with 153 pips, and 153 pips paid 12000 $367. So if your system is not producing on a daily basis like my FX trigger system, I suggest you get your hands on it. To do so, all you have to do is look right below this video and you'll see this right up. It's my FX trigger system. I do charge $250 for it. I teach how to trade the flow of the market. If you don't learn this, you will fail. My FX trigger system has well over four gigabytes of training. And you'll get an exact copy of my system on your MT4 platform. Now there's five MT4 templates, 12 custom indicators, and of course my favorite meter. Now I threw in a lot of PDF books, a lot of Word documents, and nine bonus videos. Um, this is what you're gonna need, a lot of education to succeed. Now there's 43 training videos for for the FX trigger system. I did throw in one bonus one. This one right here, it's called How to Backtest Using the Trading Simulator. It's about 50 minutes long, packed with uh, lots of tips and tricks on, on how to trade um, using this simulator. So there's a lot of ways that I do teach. I, I suggest you put this on pause. I'm not going to go through everything. If you have any questions at all, quite simple. All you got to do is pick up the phone and call me. Here's my number. If you live too far, easy. Just send me an email. Remember, there's an underscore right here. Now, I do prefer Skype. Made it easy for you. All you got to do is click on this link, and we will have Skype connection. And through Skype screen sharing, I'll give you a free session and answer your questions and give you some tips and tricks. Remember that is with no obligation to you. Now if you click on this link right here, you'll see 34 screenshots of all the trigger systems I've been building over the years. So that just about wraps up this video and uh, this day of trading. And I'll repeat it one more time. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. So until the next trade and trading day, 
Good luck with your trading and remember to keep yourself and your family safe. Okay, bye for now.